our mineral wealth. Children, look around you. Everything around you is made of different materials. Can you name some of the materials? Think, from where do we get these materials? Things around us are made up of different types of materials. We get many of these materials from the rock. Rocks are made up of different types of minerals. Minerals are naturally occurring substances. Digging our minerals from the surface of the earth is called mining. The holes dug in the earth to take out minerals are called mines. Some mines are very deep. Others are near or at the surface. Now let us learn about metals and non-metals. The materials we get from rocks are of two types metals and non-metals. Things such as cooking utensils, pins, nails, bodies of cars, and airplanes are made up of hard shining materials. They are called metals, iron, copper, gold, and aluminium are metals. Minerals from which metals are obtained are called ores. Things such as petrol, coal, mica, and limestone are not hard and shiny like metals. They are called non-metals. Iron is one of the most useful metals. It is used to make utensils, machines, tools, bridges, buildings, railway engines, and coaches, and many other things. In India, iron ore is found in large quantities in Bihar, Jharkhand, Odisha, Madhya Pradesh, Chhattisgarh, Goa, Karnataka, and Andhra Pradesh. Since pure iron is rather soft, it is usually used in the form of steel. Iron ore is converted into iron and steel. Some of these are located in Jamshedpur and Bokaro in Jharkhand, Bhilai in Chhattisgarh, and Durgapur in Bengal. Copper was the first metal used by humans to make tools and utensils. Today, it is mainly used by the electrical industry, as electricity flows easily through copper. Electric wires in our homes are made of copper. Copper is also used to make utensils and pipes. In India, copper ore is mainly found in Rajasthan and Dharakhand. Aluminium is a light metal. It also does not rust, unlike iron, which is heavy and rusts when exposed to air. It is mainly used to make bodies of aircraft and cars. It is also used to make utensils and electric wires. Aluminium ore is found in many states of India. Gold is used to make ornaments. It is found in Kolar, Manganese, Silver, Zinc, and Nickel are some other metals found in India. Coal is formed from the remains of plants that died millions of years ago. Coal is classified as a non-renewable energy source, because it takes millions of years to form. It is an important fuel that provides us with energy. It is used to generate electricity, to run factories. India has large reserves of coal. It is mainly found in Jharkhand. Madhya Pradesh, Telangana, Chhattisgarh, and West Bengal. Crude oil or petroleum is a fossil fuel formed over millions of years from the dead remains of sea animals. Like coal, it is an important source of energy. We get fuel such as petrol, diesel, kerosene, and cooking gas from petroleum. 
We also get other things from petroleum such as lubricants, plastics, and cosmetics. Did you know? A fuel is a material such as wood, coal, gas or oil that is burned to produce heat or energy. A fossil fuel is a fuel that is made from the remains of plants and animals, such as coal and petroleum. Petroleum is found deep under the earth and under the floor of the sea. Deep wells, called oil wells, are drilled to pump out the petroleum. In India, it is found mainly in Assam, Gujarat, and under the sea in Bombay High, near Mumbai. Recently, large deposits of petroleum have been found in Rajasthan and in the Krishna Godavari Basin in the Bay of Bengal. Petroleum is separated into different products in petroleum refineries. This process is called refining of petroleum. In India, there are petroleum refineries in Mumbai, Cochin, Mathura, Barani and Haldia. Two new refineries have come up in Wadi Nar and Jamnagar in Gujarat. Natural gas is found along with petroleum in some oil wells. It is mainly used as a fuel. Mica, limestone and rock salt are some other non-metal minerals found in India. Conservation of our mineral wealth the mineral resources of the earth are limited. Mineral fuels such as coal, petroleum, and natural gas take millions of years to form. Coal deposits will probably last us for about 250 years. Resources that are gone forever and once used are known as exhaustible resources. Our mineral resources are exhaustible. Therefore, there is need today to conserve them. We should use them carefully. There is need to use more and more of the inexhaustible sources of energy such as solar, wind, and water energy. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel, and do not forget to hit the bell icon to stay updated. Your comments and suggestions are valuable to us.